until D-Day or departure day. Now I'm heading to Egypt at the end of the year and I've been learning as much Arabic as possible. So I thought I'd come here to Edgware Road in London where there are a whole bunch of Egyptian restaurants to test out my Arabic. So I'm gonna order some lunch now because it's lunchtime and I'm hungry. Let's go inside Shuashi. So that was the first time I put into practice what I've learned in Arabic and I think it was a success. I think I'm ready to go to Egypt now. about my trip coming up to Egypt in December now but what better way to get in the mood than to come to the British Museum here in London now the British Museum that is actually famous for having the most extensive and largest collection of uh, Egyptian antiquities outside of the museum in Cairo so let's go take a look inside British Museum there are two different Rosetta stones now this one here is the copy while the original one is actually on the other side of the museum but if Rosetta stone is so popular that I thought I'd come to the copy because there are no crowds around now the reason why the Rosetta stone is so important is that it holds the key to deciphering hieroglyphics so up until the fourth century they actually lost all records of how to read write and decipher hieroglyphics and it wasn't until 1799 that they actually found the Rosetta stone and were able to use the Greek inscription to translate the hieroglyphics so this is obviously the inspiration for the language learning app Rosetta Stone so let's see how you have it Wadan Marhaban Marhaban few weeks since I first started learning Arabic and progress is a little bit slower than I expected but that's only because I'm used to learning European languages now as I said in my first video Arabic is a completely different ball game so I've got to learn the scripture I've got to learn the new sounds but I am making progress which I'm very happy with and as you saw today I was able to actually speak to someone for the first time so I actually put into practice what I've learnt so hopefully once it gets to December I have a bit more confidence and I can speak a little bit more once I get to Egypt now if you guys are interested in your own language challenge then you can use the link below and you get 50% off with Rosetta Stone. You can choose any language that you like. Until next time, I'll see you then. Bye!